So easily one of the biggest new Ninjago reveals in almost a year has to be the new image for Zane's Jet Set, releasing later on this year in the summer. And although we've had about a day now to really take all of this in, believe it or not there is still one detail that a lot of people seem to be missing, which is precisely what we are going to be discussing here today. So for those of you that may have forgotten what the uh, set box art looks like, here it is. And yeah, that's basically it. There's nothing too, you know, out of the ordinary going on here, is there? You've got the amazing looking uh, box art design that they've got going on. I'm a big fan of the purple colour scheme. Well, if we just take a look at the top right kind of area, and if we zoom all the way in, there is a kind of flying castle. Now at a first glance it does almost look like Borg Tower, but Borg Tower has been completely kind of changed in some kind of evil way, you know. It's looking quite dark over there, quite menacing, and they've changed kind of the overall shaping of it, but again, it does still hold on to that Borg Tower design. Well, anyway, aside from all of that, this does seem to possibly be Possibly, again, take this with a grain of salt because this is just a theory on my part, but I believe that there could be a very strong chance that this is actually the Crystal King Temple set mentioned in the set descriptions. And also another thing to back this up, be the fact that the set description for this set did actually mention floating rocks. Well, I mean, the fact that this entire castle is in the air, floating rocks don't really seem to out of the ordinary, do they? So honestly, I think this could easily be our first look at the overall outline for the Crystal King Temple set. And I think this is basically what it's going to be looking like. And this is what we can kind of expect to see within the actual set. Of course, it will be scaled down from this and it won't look quite as grand, I guess. But still, this is definitely something to keep in mind when anticipating the upcoming set uh, for this Crystal King Temple. Now, for my personal thoughts on this, I'd say that it looks really, really awesome. I'm getting heavy Jestro Castle vibes from Nexo Knights, if you guys remember that theme and that set. It definitely does resemble that, just with the relatively skinny, very tall design it's got going on. It looks really kind of clunky, messy, which of course is an amazing thing for this. It gives it a slightly more natural kind of look, I guess, and it just makes the whole thing look really amazing, and I cannot wait to see how this actually looks in set form. I am really expecting big things, and yeah, I just cannot wait to actually see the set revealed to us. Hopefully, it's going to look something very similar to this. But that basically does sum up today's video. I just kind of wanted to share this with you all because I haven't really seen anybody talk about it, really. But yeah, hopefully you enjoyed today's video, and I hope you guys appreciate this news here. As usual, if you did enjoy today's video, please do feel free to drop a like on it. If you're new to the channel and are interested in seeing a lot of content similar to this, then please also do consider subscribing to the channel with that notification bell turned on. And with all of this being said, I will see you all in my next video coming very, very soon. Goodbye.